Hi, so in this video, we're going to be interpreting inequalities. So we're going to be describing the subset of real numbers that the inequality represents. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to take a look at our first example here, letter A. And it says that x is less than or equal to 2. So what that's telling us is that all real numbers are less than or equal to 2. And so here we will have a bracket at our 2, and we would have an arrow pointing this way if we were to see it graphically. And what about B? X is greater than negative 1. Why don't you push pause and try and describe that yourself first, and then push unpause when you're done, and see if you're right. So I got all real numbers are greater than negative 1. So what would the, that look like if we were to graph it? Now, if we had been asked to graph it, we would see a parenthesis at negative 1, and then the arrow would point towards all of the bigger numbers. Again, we didn't need to do that this time, but I think it's important that we see what that looks like. So let's look at our next example. Negative 2 is less than or equal to x, which is less than 3. Go ahead and try this one too. Push pause, and then come back when you're done and push play, and we'll see if you're right. So here I got all real numbers between negative 2 and 3, including negative 2, but not including 3. So what would this look like if we looked at it graphically? So here we would see a bracket at our negative 2 and a parenthesis at our 3, and then the line would connect the two. And so that's how you interpret inequalities.